If you received a gram stain kit with a notice stating that the grams iodine will need to be recalibrated before kit installation, please follow these steps. This process will only need to be performed once per Gram Pro 1 unit. Before beginning the process, install the new kit bottles onto the Gram Pro 1. From the Home menu, press 1 to select Run, press 4 to select Purge. Remove the front pump cover by unscrewing the four thumb screws on the face of the Gram Pro 1. If your unit was purchased after September 16, 2019, it will have a four-pin Molex connection attaching three case fans on the cover. Pivot the pump cover along the left side of the machine. Carefully disconnect the Molex connection and lay down the pump cover. Remove the Grams iodine pump tube from the third motor on the bottom row of pump rollers. This tube may be discarded. Carefully place a new pump tube on this roller. Be sure to keep the original placement of clear lines above the roller so that the two clear lines cross each other. From the main menu, press pound to select the password screen. Press zero, then press pound. A new screen prompting service mode selected, enter password, will appear. On this screen, press the keys 7, 5, 9, 0 in succession. Doing so correctly will take you back to the main menu. To ensure this process was done correctly, press 8 on the main menu to access one of the service menus. If you see the following screen, then the password has been entered correctly. Press the star key to exit back to the main menu. Press 2 to select setup. Press 1 to select Calibration. Press 9 on this screen to access a service menu. Press 1 to select Set Fill Levels. Press 7 to change the top of the screen to say Grams Iodine. Press 0 to select Test Calibration. Press 4 to select Drain. Once the draining has completed, press 5 to select Purge. Press Star to exit back one screen. Press 9 to select Set Calibration. Press 1 to select Prime. Press 1 again to select Interactive Setup. Press and hold 3 until you begin to see Gram's iodine filling the cuvette. If you accidentally fill the cuvette too much, press 1 to select Less until the cuvette drains almost completely. A little fluid in the cuvette is okay. Press 6 to select Accept. Press Star 2 times to exit back two screens. Press 0 to select Test Calibration. Press 4 to select Drain. Press 2 to select Gap. Press Star to exit back one screen. Press 9 to select Set Calibration. Press 3 to select Fill. Before proceeding, place a blank slide in the cuvette. Once the slide is ready, press 1 to select Interactive Setup. Press and hold 3 to select More until you see Graham's iodine fill the cuvette. Let go when you see the fluid levels reach the top two Phillips head screws on the cuvette. Press six to select Accept. Press star two times to exit back two screens. Press zero to select Test Calibration. Press four to select Drain. Once the draining is complete, press five to select Purge. The calibrations are now complete. You may verify the calibration by pressing the following sequence of buttons. Press 1 to select Prime. Press 4 to select Drain. Press 2 to select Gap. Press 3 to select Fill. After these steps, the Grams iodine level should return to the new calibrated level of reaching the top of the two Phillips head screws. Press star once to exit. You may now remove the slide from the cuvette. Proceed back to the main menu by pressing star to select exit. Once you are on the main menu, press 1 to select run.
press 3 to select Prime Pumps. Once the prime has been completed, power cycle the Gram Pro 1 to exit out of the service mode. You have now successfully calibrated the Gram's iodine fill level for the Gram Pro 1. You may now proceed with registering the kit and lot information.